Hi, I'm Chantel with Brampton Focus. We're here at the Journey Neighborhood Center with Kevin Birmingham, the manager of the Journey. We know that 50 or over 50% of families in the region of Peel right now live on the poverty line. So Kevin, what is the Journey doing to help address this issue? I think we're helping in several ways. Uh, one of them is we're coordinating with other organizations. So we have the region of Peel coming in and helping people with housing. We have CMHA coming in and providing counseling for people. Uh, we have a number of programs, uh, early years programs, STEM uh, programs for children, after school programming, trying to give uh, families some hope, some context, uh, trying to help them with their specific immediate needs, but also trying to address the longer term issues that they face because of that precariousness that they're living in. Now, I think one of the main challenges they have at this time is uh, economic. Uh, they have precarious employment issues, which leads to a whole cascading series of other issues. So, for example, we're dealing more and more with people who are on the verge of homelessness, and they just don't have a lot of options, and therefore they tend to lose hope. They, they look forward and they go, ah, I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't see any options. I don't know how I can live here. And so we try to address that through, I mean, our mission statement is to bring hope and transformation as we walk alongside with these families and they make decisions. So we do that through the programs that I mentioned earlier and through just being available for people. They could come in, they can walk into this place and we can chat with them. We can recommend services, other organizations and places that they can go to address that. Sure, I, th I think there's three benefits that come from the camp. Uh, one of them is for the children, obviously. They have a great opportunity. Uh, the second is actually for the parents. It gives them a break. Uh, a lot of them are single parent families. Um, the mom's under a lot of stress in that and just gives her an opportunity to have a day to herself to deal with whatever needs to be dealt with. And finally, for our, our student staff, we have uh, students that are part of the Peel Summer Job Challenge. We have others that we hire through a federal summer program. It gives them work experience. And I think more importantly, uh, there's a lot of fulfillment in running a program with children, uh, a lot of opportunity for them to, um, to discover more about themselves, leadership, how to deal with conflict, uh, how to work together as a team. So there's a lot of benefits for them as well. I think it's actually a really unique position being able to, to be a part of this. Uh, I have the opportunity to oversee um, a bunch of children coming in and having uh, probably one of the best summer experiences that they will remember. Uh, we also have the opportunity to deal with um, youth and young adults that uh, may be having a little bit of trouble finding jobs or, or getting that work experience, so we get to do that with them. There are a lot of uh, awesome things that we get to do. So I know that right now um, the children get to experience the library, um, which promotes literacy and, and the, the critical skills that they're going to need as they grow up and as they move through life. Um, just a couple weeks ago, we had the opportunity to have um, uh, Peel Safety Village come in. And so they got to meet their community members. They get to know um, who firefighters are, what they do. And it gives them the opportunity to just kind of see themselves um, see themselves in the future, the things that they want to do, the things that they would be able to do. Uh, we do our best to, to encourage them and support them and just kind of give them the skills that they need growing up. And I think that that's really, really important and crucial to them, um, especially when um, the world is showing them so many possibilities, but they may not feel like they have the skills to do so. So here we try to equip everyone um, to be set for this journey that they'll be taking in their life. Well, of course, uh, we are on Facebook, so if you search up the Journey Neighborhood Center, um, we also have our website, www.thejourneyneighborhoodcenter.ca, and there you can find out more information about who we are and what we do.